to let me execute him while he's sleeping? <laughs> yeah! That's the way I roll! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. You know, a teenage girl? Boom! Freaking bullet to your temple. What's up, my hungry friends? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my 7 Days to Die modded starvation mod Let's Play. Last episode, we got the full exosuit. What up? All right, that was pretty freaking cool. You know, I actually forgot, like, at the end of the video, I wanted to, like, shoot the gun in the video. And I thought, honestly, I kind of thought Alpha 16 would be out, like, maybe. Um, and I thought I might never get to shoot the gun. And I saw a bunch of survivors over here, and none of them were teenage girls, so they all needed to be killed. Um... I mean, that's legit, right? They need that, that needed to happen. All right, guys. All right, today we are going to be... By the way, the reason I'm killing everyone who's not a teenage survivor is because I have no use for these people. And I need a teenage girl survivor to turn into a farmer. All right, so let's get started. All right, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please remember to give it a like. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. So today, um, she's not a teenage survivor either. You're not a teenage survivor! <laughs> Everyone come to Cage's House of Pain! <laughs> By the way, one of you guys gave me the idea to rename that to Cage's House of Pain, so I thought it was a really good idea. So I did. Um, you're not a teenage survivor. Or maybe, maybe you are, but you're not a girl, so you got to go. Alright, right up there you can see my farm kind of fell apart. I'm going to bring you up to speed on that. Um, we're going to be doing some uh, farming here. I really want to get it. I really want to get a farmer going here, but it's taking a while. I also need to, uh, actually, you know what, before I do anything, before I do anything, because I keep forgetting to do this, let's work with the talking head, alright? Should we put this in my room? Let's put this in my room. I mean, this is where I need it, you know? This is where I need the talking head, so put it right next to my bed, and I could talk to it at night, you know? Um, oh, you can't place it on that? Wait. No, yeah, you can. There we go! <laughs> Search the talking head. Wait, let's see if we can hear it. By the way, that's how you pick it up. You search it and then pick it up. That would be an afterlife. You can't hear it, can you? Hold on one second. These are these are uh, funny quotes from... Uh, I've noticed one of them. Um, they're coming to get you, Barbara. It's from, uh, it's from Night of the Living Dead. So let's uh, turn this up. All right, let's see. Say something. Damn it, I picked them up. Son of a biscuit. Hold on. They're coming for you. Can you hear that? You know what? You guys got to hear this. I got to make sure you hear this. Right, let's try this. That would be an afterlife. Hmm. Oh, what was that? I didn't hear that. Oh, wait. I got extra heads? Wait, why is he still there? Oh, there he goes. He's gone. All right. They're coming for you. They're coming for you, Barbara. Oh, I love it. So that's freaking cool. Let's turn down the volume before I forget and get attacked by a zombie. Oh, my goodness. Oh, all right. So there we go. A nice addition to any bedroom. Um, you think my sanity is going to go up? Now it's really going to go up. It's going to go up like crazy. All right. So let's get going. Let's take a look around, see if we have any survivors in this area. I'm not seeing. Wow, I can hear that head from over here. That's hilarious. Anyway, all right. So, um, all of these, uh, all of these things fell off. All right, all these, uh, all these railings. Remember, I, I did all these railings, and I was so proud of them and so happy about it. Well, they all fell apart. Okay, uh, it kind of sucks, but basically, what happened was when I picked up a torch, they all fell down. So I'm not really sure what was going on there. Uh, I tried to put them back by putting uh railings right there you know like i did originally and as soon as i upgrade them they fall apart the only thing that was holding them up was the torches and i didn't know that so what i did was i went ahead and used uh the wood pole blocks you can see right here there you go you see right there the wood pole blocks and oh there's also some other stuff on here i want to get rid of i was i was playing around with uh i was playing around with um uh, what are those called plates but i like the pole blocks on the bottom so you can see right there. I actually think it looks better with the pole blocks on the bottom. It kind of gives the, it kind of gives the the build a little bit of, um, I don't know, a little bit of dimension, even without the, f the fact that you need it for these, for these railings. 
Okay. Um, I do not have a lot of iron, though, so... Oh, look at this guy, man. Look at him. He's, like, buried in stuff. Survivors should come with stuff, man. Give me something for having to waste ammo on you. Anyway, alright. So, we can't do much with the farm right now. Uh, because we need to put down a lot of spikes. Let's do that. We also need to... Oh, I know what we need to do. We need to grab the generator. Alright, this guy actually made the generator for me. So let's go ahead and bring the generator over here. I kind of wanted to put down the farmer first. But I don't think that's going to work. Any... Uh, where do I want to put the... Well, I can put down the generator first. Right? I can put down the generator because that doesn't need to be really close to anything. So basically, the way these power cables work... I know I went over this, but it was like freaking 20 30 episodes ago uh basically the way you make these power cables is you make the original power cable which uh this the, the one you're looking for does not take any other power cables to make there we go that's the one you want power cable ground it takes copper and duct tape and then you can make other power cables from the power cable ground all right so that's how you do that all right so we got a cross right here so we're gonna put that right there and i'm thinking this side is the bigger side so this should come across to here I think that is probably okay. Let's um, let's count this out. I'd actually like to make sure this is this is proper. I'm just gonna put it down right there. The hell with it. That's good enough. We'll have spikes underneath too. So there we go. So I guess uh, you just can pick it up. So you either pick it up or put it down. I don't know. Can I turn it on? Let's see if we, no. You can only pick it up or put it down. Oops. Damn it! Stop picking it up. Cage. All right. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come in here. We're gonna need some gas for that thing. So let's go ahead and... Do I have any gas in here? I don't think I do now. All right, so let's come out in here and grab some gas. The gas is upstairs, but we might have some down here. Um, we do not. We do not. That head is really distracting. I might have to pick it up or shut it Shut it up. <laughs> shut up, you stupid head. All right, so we're going to take care of that. By the way, my chickens were almost starved to death, so I had to make some chicken feed, so that's kind of a problem. All right, so we got another survivor up there. That's Michonne. That's the Michonne survivor. Pretty sure she's not a teenager. Although, I guess I don't know for sure. Let's have her followers. I'm almost positive she's not. But let's just let's just see. Alright, come on, come with me, Michonne. Oh, look at her. She's so fast. Come on, Michonne, over here. There you go. Can you get up here? Can you get up here? No, you cannot. Alright, I'll try one more time. I'm not gonna mess around with her. I'll probably build a staircase or something off camera. If she won't come up here. Come on. No. Alright, forget it. Alright, why don't you uh why don't you stay right here? Why don't you patrol? Patrol, Michonne. I don't know what good you're gonna do, but you know, get out there and patrol. Alright, so let's put some gas in here. Now once we have the ultrasonic thing, um, we should be able to now I don't have the farmer yet, but the thing is, if I have the ultra if I have the ultrasonic thing going, alright, it's green. Um, I can keep the rats from spawning. I can actually start farming myself. That's the idea. I'd like to just start farming myself. Um, and then when we get the farmers, they can take over. Did she see me? I don't know. Pretty sure she did. No, she didn't. She's right below me. Oh yeah, she saw me. See, now we, got, now we got zombies spawning inside. That's what the screamers do. Alright, I'll take care of this. I'm not sure exactly how she saw me. I might have to put some walls up on that farm or something. Oh, sorry. Sorry, Michonne. Oh, you know what? I never protected against screamers. I never set this thing up to protect against screamers. It's okay. I mean, uh, spider zombies. Alright, you're dead. There she is. Okay. Oh, God, there's screamers up on my farm. Ooh, that's a problem. Ooh, spiders... Sp uh, spider zombies are going to be a real problem with the farm. I didn't even think about that. Alright, fair enough. Alright, guys. Got my stuff together here. Uh, I'm not getting any more survivors, though. So, that's a little bit of a bummer. We'll just have to wait and see how that goes. But, um... Now, did she see me? 
I don't think she did. I got these buckets of water in my inventory, and I need to keep them for a specific reason. Uh, and we'll get into that later. I need to build this part of the wall up. The fact that this uh, screamer keeps seeing me is really, really irritating. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and put down some lights. Again, these lights work uh, 20 by 20. They work, they work uh, very, very well. Um, very, very large radius, you know what I'm saying? So um, I think we'll put one right here. Well, that doesn't point to it. Will that work? Oh, it does. Okay. And then we'll put one right... Uh, well, we can put down one more piece of wood, I guess. Yeah, we might as well. It's not like it's taking up any more farm area. It's just taking up a little bit of water area. Not really that big of a deal. I can never tell when that screamer screams or not. Like, I can't tell the difference between her I'm here scream and her I saw you I'm calling the horde scream. So, I'm just going to ignore her for the time being. Let's just put this right there. And then put this one over here. All right, yeah, this should work. This should work. Where's my nail gun? Damn it! Up, oh, it's on my hopper. There you go. All right, so we'll put that right there. Put that right there. Put this right there. Now this farm should be good to go. I don't know for sure, but let's come down here and see what's going on with the wall. Um, the wall's doing just fine. The wall's doing just fine. Let's put up some spikes. Let's put the spikes where we think there's going to be the most problem with the rats, like in this corner. This is where I think that will be the most problem with the rats. So there we go. And um, I also want the uh, spikes to be... I want the spikes to be surrounding anything that the rats could attack. You know what I mean? So, I mean, they could probably be in here. These spikes are really, really expensive, but what are you going to do? I still think it's the best, uh, the best choice. Alright, so let's do this. I think I'm going to plant some uh, plant some things myself. After Oh my god, I'm already out. Sheesh. You know what we need to do? We need to start... Alright, these guys are pissing me off. I gotta take care of these guys. Oh, never mind. Sounds like they've taken care of themselves. Anyway, uh, what I have to do is I need to start a tree farm. That's what I really need to do is start a tree farm. Alright, any, any survivors? Alright, we got one right there. It's not a teenage girl. So let me execute him while he's sleeping. <laughs> yeah, that's the way I roll. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. You know, a teenage girl, boom! Freaking bullet to your temple. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not a creeper. I need a teenage girl because it's the only kind of uh, survivor that can be a farmer. Right, so we have 31. Let's go ahead and make 25 more. And let's just start planting some stuff. Uh, the, the rat thing, I don't really know. We'll just have to wait and see. I could, I could deal with the rats myself, I just don't want to have to. I want to get this farm going, though. It's been long enough, right? I mean, am I right? So let's get this farm going. Alright, so. Let's, uh, what do we have? Oh, we don't have anything on us. Crap. Oh, that's right. We put all our, we put all our seeds in here. Um, so let's go ahead. By the way, I taught, I taught my cook how to make boiled meat. So that is just wonderful. Alright, um, tomato seeds, uh, wheat grain is fine. Um, actually, no, wheat, wheat grain is not fine. Um, first of all, let's just drop off some stuff really quick. <laughs> you hear that? It's from Reservoir Dogs. He said, you gonna bark all day, little doggy? Or are you gonna bite? Oh, great movie. Okay, so. We got tomato and strawberry. You know what? It's pretty good to start off with, honestly. I don't see anything else in here I really care, care that as much about. So let's go ahead and start planting this stuff. Um, we're also gonna grab some dirt... I think the dirt is in here. And where is the dirt? Where is the dirt? Du -du 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 dirt. Where? Really, where is it? That's not where I put it. Okay, fine. We're gonna die! What's that from? Okay, I finally found what I uh, was looking for. <laughs> Man, it took me a long time to find these damn things. Oh, I've just got chests, like, everywhere. I, th I think we still got some screamers out here. Which is unfortunate. But we got we gotta take care of this. We gotta take care of this. By the way, that you're gonna die thing is from Starship Troopers. I knew I knew it from somewhere. Oh, such a good movie. Man, whoever man, whoever put these uh, quotes in here has unbelievably good taste in in, in movies and stuff. All right, I should probably make this a little bit taller. Uh, I'm just worried about screamers being able to see me, but for now I'm not gonna worry too much about it. All right, so let's just take care of this. Okay. 
Come on over here. It doesn't seem like there's any screamers out there right now. Which is nice. We'll leave that alone for now. We're just kind of doing this quick and dirty. Uh, I'm not even going to worry. Well, ah, I got to pick up the freaking light. Okay. Let's pick up the freaking light. Ouch! My freaking ears! Alright, there we go. Alright, so let's put this stuff down, like so. Again, this is just really, really quick and dirty. But it'll get the job done. And this stuff needs to be upgraded anyway, so that is perfectly fine. There we go. And I do not have a lot of wood. I gotta go get some wood. I actually got some wood off camera, but um, there's not a lot of wood in my area anymore, so that's why I have to start a tree farm. Remember, you need... You need... Um, uh, you need water in order for the trees to grow so i need to make some kind of tree farm with water all right that's still not high enough it's still not high enough i think i should just make it higher the hell of it right whoops yep yep that is definitely from starship troopers i i knew i knew it from somewhere right am i right people all right, so let's put that right there. Let's put this along. This should make us completely uh, invisible to the screamers. Well, invisible because they can't see through walls, hopefully. Don't, let's not give the fun pimps any ideas. Or the starvation guys, right? All right, so let's do that. Can screamers see through unupgraded rebar? That would be an interesting thing to, no to note. Anybody uh, have any idea about that? We'll leave it up just as rebar for now, and we'll see. Okay, and I know this is a, a problem with the with the lights. I apologize. I will deal with that as soon as humanly possible. There we go. All right, so we should be okay in here now. Um, let's go ahead and put put up some more lights here. Uh, oh, we can't put lights on that because the, it'll it'll be in the way of the crops growing. Hmm. Interesting. All right, let's not deal with that. I'll deal with that off camera. We gotta get this. We gotta get this show on the road. Let's start planting some stuff. Oh, I caught a slight. I caught a slight flu. A slight flu. That just sounds wrong, doesn't it? All right. Well, we just gotta stay away from our survivors. Or they'll catch it. Um, I, it should go away. It would go away quicker if I was on my bed, but I think I'll be all right. I just don't want to go near any. So I don't want to forget. You know, that's what I'm kind of worried about. All right, let's just go ahead and start planting some stuff. Now, the reason I'm planting tomatoes is because tomatoes I can work, I can put with cans, and I can make canned tomatoes, which won't go bad. It's uh, the best thing that I can make to take on the road. And I am going to be planting uh, strawberries because uh, actually no no yes yeah, strawberries because strawberry juice is a great uh, is a great drink uh, because it ups your wellness even even more than uh, goldenrod. There we go. And I'll plant these over here. Try and separate the crops a little bit. She's not my base, is she? No. We broke a hole over there, though. I'm going to have to go deal with these with these screamers. You know what? We haven't had a lot of zombie action in this video. Why don't I go, why don't I go mess around screamers as soon as I'm done planting this? got the flu. I gotta remember to get rid of that flu, man. I'm really... Although, I guess it doesn't matter as much because as long as, you're, as, long as your survivors can heal, you have, they have the food to heal. Um, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. So, we'll see. Okay, no more flu. I sound great, right? No more flu! Yeah, alright. Any uh, more survivors? I don't see any. That is fine. Let's go out and kick the crap out of some screamers. Or if there's anything else out there. I don't hear them anymore. Hey, look, I can run with the gun out now. I wonder why. Bring it. Oops. Wait, I'm not wearing it? Wait, hold on, I'm confused. How am I not wearing the armor? Okay, I'm confused. It says I can't wear the... I can't use it without the power armor? Does it have to be powered? You need to wear it powered. Oh, you have to use... Wow, you have to have the thing powered to use the minigun. Ooh, I didn't know that. I thought that was just for the uh, radiation bonus. 
Oh, crap. Well, that's, um... That's gonna complicate things. Uh, wow. Okay, so I gotta save power course. I have to save power course. All right. All right. Well, in that case, let's get our let's get another gun. I'm gonna save that for the uh, uh, for Horde Knight. All right. So let's uh, actually that's a full gun that doesn't go in there. Full guns go up here. And let's grab our HK sixteen. And let's put these bullets away as well. That's a bummer. I'm a little bit disappointed about that. But I guess they don't want it to be overpowered. I thought I thought you only needed power for the uh, for the thing to give you protection against radiation. Okay, here we are. Oh boy. Oh. Piece of crap screamers. I hate screamers. Hello. Take out your leg. Take out your head. Alright, I'm going back to claim my base. Well, at least I still get that stamina boost, or am I? I don't feel like I'm getting the stamina boost unless it's powered. Maybe I'm wrong, though. All right. Oh, we got a lot of we got a lot of zombies here. Making sure. Am I immune to stun? Because they don't seem to be able to stun me. There you go. Oh boy, they actually broke through. Steel arrows. What? This has been a corpse that got broken. How did they break through? You know, I, I think I know how they break. I think I know how they broke through. I think they were standing on the on the gore blocks while hitting the block. Because you can stand on gore blocks and um, not take any damage from the spikes, and I believe that's what they were doing. Alright, well, fair enough. Um, we just have to make this a uh, bit better of a defense. Oh. Alright, yeah. Okay. Alright, do I have any spikes on me? No, I don't. Let me, uh, get in here. Let's break this, let's break this guy out, replace the wall. And I think we're, I think next video we're gonna have to worry about spikes. Come on. There you go. All right. There you go. Head, head, what was that called? Head, head hunter. Yeah, head hunter. That's what I'm talking about. What's my next Fortnite? What was my last one? I don't remember. I want to say 79, but I really don't know. There we go. All right, well. What we're going to do is, uh, I'm going to be working on... Oh, we got a teenage survivor. Beautiful. Hold on. Hold on to that thought, people. All right, guys. The morning. She should be up. All right, you. Follow me. Come on. Come on. You're good. She's trampling all my crops. You got to love it. All right. Well, that's okay. There we go. All right. We got ourselves a farmer. Oop. Oops. No. Uh, we got a... Whatever error that is. Um, no reference error. Uh, why don't you do low tier plants? Okay, blueberry, goldenrod, chrysanthemums, or sunflower. Well, that's easy. I wanted to do sunflower. But before we do that, we're going to go ahead and put down a refrigerator. Um, I don't really think it matters where it goes, to be honest. I don't know how close these refrigerators have to be. Alright, whatever. That's close enough. Alright, let's go get her. First, we're going to close that door. So other survivors come in here. Now that we got her, we're going to want another one because we want two farmers over here. So let's go get her some seeds. Now, um, what she really needs is, what we what we really need mostly, most, is the sunflower seeds. I need to feed those rabbits. 
And I have plenty of wheat. I just don't have a lot of sunflower uh, seeds. A lot of sunflower seeds. Yeah, so I gotta, I gotta have her do that. So let's go on over here. I did plant some, but I doubt they're they're done. No, they're not even close to being done. Jeez, I have nothing. Okay, guys, we're gonna we're gonna put her to work next video. Okay, um, next video. I need to. I, I feel like I was very scatterbrained this video. I think next video we need to be more focused. I think next video I'm going to. Um, work on getting that the farmer the second farmer getting that farmer squared away spikes underneath to defend against rats and I need to put spikes around the base as well all right guys so that's gonna be it for this video I'll see you next time and until then take it easy